my channel. Today I thought I'd go a little bit old school with YouTube and do a good old fashioned pack with me video. Now I haven't done one of these in such a long time and if this is the kind of content that you enjoy, please be sure to comment below and let me know so I can provide you guys with more content that you want to see. Give this video a thumbs up. I also thought it would be a really great place for you guys to see all of the bits and bobs that I take with me on this Paris trip all in one place. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. I'm going to kick off by sharing with you guys what I've already packed for like my body and skincare and my accessories like my hair accessories and that sort of thing so I'll throw that footage in now and then once I get to Paris that's where I'm going to share with you guys the makeup bits and bobs that I'll be bringing because I'll be filming a lot of like short form beauty content so I'll share that in the Paris vlog which will be right after this vlog let me get into the main bulk of it the shoes the accessories the clothes that's the main thing so the first thing that I'm going to be taking along with me and I also kind of like pack and pop handbags and shoes like on the rail and stuff like that that's why I love this route but anyway the first thing I'm going to pack is this outfit this is the white dress that I decided to keep or one out of the two <laughs> white dresses that I decided to keep from that H&M try on video. I absolutely love this dress It's a little bit long so I'm gonna pair it with a pair of shoes Which I'll share with you guys at the end But I'm taking this white H&M dress and I'm also going to be taking this Rebecca Minkoff bag The next outfit that I'm gonna be taking I don't know if I've mentioned but I'm going to Paris So this outfit to me screams very Paris chic. This I did actually take to New York. It's from Forever New. And then I just threw this little vest top underneath to go with it, just like a little tan brown. This is a really nice sort of like white tweed skirt suit set. So I'm gonna take this along with me also. I feel like the palette for this Paris trip is very like neutral, but we do have a couple pops of color. So you guys will see that in a sec. The next outfit that I'm gonna take is this little set. It's from Arquette. I still haven't worn it yet. This was in a recent, or not recent, but this is in an Arquette haul that I did last year towards the end of last year for whatever reason still haven't had the chance to wear it so I'm gonna pack this it's a nice light like jumper and then it comes with a matching skater skirt so you guys will have seen like the try on clip and you guys will see me wearing all these pieces in the vlog as well um but just for reference most of these pieces I have hauled and I have already like tried on with you guys but this is just a quick roundup. So this is the third outfit. This is from a recent Meshki haul. This is a nice little mini turtleneck dress. And I'm gonna go ahead and pair it with this bag from Zara. It's just such a cute and easy fun bag. So that's the next outfit. This is my dish set. And I used to wear it quite a lot in the summer months because it's a nice light fabric. I thought because I have a lot of dresses and like a lot of skirts, I just wanted like a couple trouser options. I didn't need a couple because I'm not going for that long. But I just wanted at least one trouser option. I've just decided to pair it with this pink um, bustier type thing underneath from Savage X Fenty just to give it a pop of colour. So that's the dish suit set, it's like a waistcoat, it's a pair of trousers, it goes all the way down to the ground. Absolutely love this. If you guys haven't shopped on dish, you guys have to check it out. Their pieces are so nice. Next up is an oldie but a goodie. I haven't worn this in forever. This is a suit set from River Island. It's a blazer 
and then you also have a matching skirt. I found a pair of like Loewe dupe sunglasses that are pink from Primark, which I'm gonna wear with this. And then also I'm gonna pop this little bag with it because this bag goes so perfectly with it. So this is my next little suit set. The skirt is like a mini skirt. It has a little bit of a um, split in it. Nothing too crazy, but I kind of pulled this out when I did my wardrobe clear out. I have a video coming on that, but um, I, it was kind of on the chopping block and then I have this trip to Paris and I was like, well, let me just wear it to Paris and then maybe it'll be on the chopping block after that. But it's a really cute set. So in the end now, going into the pops of colour, if you guys are following me on Instagram, then you've already seen this dress. It's from Warehouse and it is the most stunning pop of colour. It's this really nice green beaded dress and yeah, I cannot wait to wear this, it's such a lovely piece. So onto my second pop of color now. This is a piece from Karen Millen. Nicole Ari Parker has done a collab with Karen Millen, which in my opinion, they kind of haven't marketed that much and I feel like they've missed a the trick there. It's this really beautiful sort of like orange cool bandeau dress. It's a midi in length, it's quite long actually. So it's, yeah, almost maxi in a way, like literally just above my ankles. It's perfect, it zips all the way up and then it has this embellishment on it. So this is the other pop of color. I've only got two pops of color. This does also come with um, detachable straps. I probably will wear it without the straps, but it's really good to know that if you don't wanna wear it like that, you can just pop the straps on easily. Next up, I've got like a chill kind of like chill vibes outfit. This is the Unitard from one of my previous H&M collections. I absolutely love it, it's like a low back. This uh, strap here is adjustable. I've just tucked my socks here because I don't want to leave them behind. These are like my Nike Stussy socks and I love to wear them with like my Nike dunks. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna bring this along. I'm also just gonna bring like one jumper, like one comfy jumper that can go over that unitard if I want it to or just go over anything to be honest if I get chilly. So I'm bringing this Adenola one. I love this colorway. I do also have the matching shorts. They're like cycling shorts, but I don't think it's warm enough for cycling shorts right now. So um, yeah, I wanted to bring this along because I'm, I'm not going with my partner. I'm going with Jade. Typically if I was going with my partner, I wouldn't really bother because he's got jumpers, but yeah, um, I needed to bring <laughs> my own this time round. Next piece, this is my last like main clothing item. I wanted to pack a black blazer. This one's from Karen Millen. It has a little zhuzh on it. It has the fluff on the end of the cup here. You know, I think I took this to Paris when I went last year um, and I wore it with this like feather dress, I think. If you guys haven't seen my Paris vlog from last year, by the way, you absolutely have to check it out. Like it's one of my favorite, favorite, favorite vlogs. And if you need like tips and guides and tricks, and definitely check out that vlog. I had the best time last year. So yeah, I think, all that to say, I think I took this last year. It's just one of those classic pieces, really. I do have plain black, black oversized blazers, but it's Paris, so I just wanted to go for something like, that was a little bit more glam, a little bit more chic. Pajamas, these are my pajamas from Anthropology. Um, I've also just tucked my socks in here. I have rainers, so like my feet and my hands are always really, really cold, and I sleep with socks on. Um, I just always do. It could be summer, I will sleep with socks on because of my rainers. My, my feet are nearly always cold. So this is a pair of pajamas from Anthropology. These are really cool actually because this is the trouser one, but I do also have the shorts one for like when it is summer. Um, but obviously it's spring, it's a little chilly, so I'm bringing the trouser version. Oh, I'm also bringing this. Do I need to bring it? I don't know, if you guys have seen my vlogs, I don't know if I mentioned it in a vlog, but basically this is a little house dress from Savage X Fenty. It reminds me a little bit of Skims, um, but this is just for me to like wear if I'm in the apartment and you know, like wandering around and stuff like that. Like if I don't necessarily wanna wear my pajamas, I have like a little black dress. Um, it's also really good for like filming beauty content. I like to film beauty content when I'm wearing um, usually something that's black, but now I'm thinking about it. If I'm gonna be doing hair content, you can't see my hair when I'm so. Maybe I'll leave this behind, I don't know. But that's my little Savage XMT house dress, which is now on the floor. So my last item of clothing is this piece from Dish. I have my sunglasses on here because I'm actually wearing this as my outfit to travel in tomorrow. The reason why I'm not really like, the thing is I'm not really a travel in a dress kind of girl, but this goes all the way down to the floor. The reason why I'm not a travel in a dress is because I don't want the back of my legs to touch the seat. I don't know if you guys are like that. I, I, I'm a bit like germaphobe in a way. Um, so yeah, I like to make sure that I'm like covered. Um, but 
we're going Eurostar, so that makes it so much easier. Like, I love traveling Eurostar. Anyway, um, this this dress, beautiful dress. I have it in this like khaki color, long sleeve, goes all the way down to the ground. Um, it does have a tie on it. I have it in a size small. I'd recommend if you're in between sizes. Yeah, this is small. If you're in between sizes, you can size down with this dress. There's a lot of fabric to it. I love it, it's stunning. I'm gonna pair it with my Mac but you guys will see that in the vlog when I start vlogging tomorrow. But this is my travel outfit because, yeah, when we get to Paris, I wanna be looking chic and ready to go, but I wanna be comfortable. So this is the outfit. So quickly gonna run through shoes now. I have this pair of court shoes, which I just picked up from H&M and I'm obsessed with them. They're like a leopard print, so super cheap. They're like 27.99, which is mad, especially if you've got coupons like three pound coupon, you can get them for even cheaper. So that's the first pair. I'm also gonna bring, my loafers, I'm thinking about it because I, I have an outfit in mind. You know the Arquette co-ord with the skirt? I think this could look nice with a pair of socks and that. But I'm still thinking about it, so mm, jewelry's still out, but I think I'm gonna bring them. <laughs> so I have another H&M special. These are a nice pair of like, the thing is, I'm not gonna lie, they're kitten heels. I'm, I'm a kitten heel babe now, like I'm, I'm just there. Because the thing is, it's like these are really comfortable, but they're a bit too kitten. What do you guys think? Are you wearing kitten heels? <laughs> Let me know. I don't know, the millennial in me doesn't want to wear kitten heels. Like, I just always want to do like really high, but A, I'm tall, and B, which should be A, it's not practical, it's not comfortable. So I'm a kitten heel bay. Not to mention these were like 27.99 as well. So that's my other pair. So I was gonna bring these sandals. I still am actually, just in case. They're from H&M, again, so super cheap. I'm just thinking if I need them, but I kind of do, because I don't have a flat option that isn't trainers. And then, lastly, I'm gonna bring these trainers. They're just my brown and white dong. I'm actually gonna wear them, so I don't need to pack them. So I'm gonna pop the outfit that I'm wearing tomorrow back onto the rail gonna throw the rest of this into the suitcase and yeah that will literally be it I'm gonna throw it into the suitcase I'm just bringing like a medium size pink suitcase should be easy enough for me to wheel around and then for hand luggage I'm just bringing my big pink rare beauty bag um, because it has a zip on it and I'm gonna walk with like my valuables and stuff like that like on me so we might do a bag drop because we're checking in at one and we're getting in at 9.30. So yeah, that was my very quick Paris pack with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But yeah, if you are a makeup girly, definitely be sure to check out the Paris vlog because I'm gonna do like a what's in my makeup bag once I get there and things like that. But it's like 10.30, I need to finish editing a vlog for you guys. And I am gonna get up quite early actually just to get myself organized and prepped and all that sort of stuff. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please let me know. Let me know what kind of content you guys wanna see. And that is about it from me. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in Paris. Bisous. <laughs>